What's up, fam? It's me, Christina Wong. Uh, I'm a performance artist and elected official in Koreatown, Los Angeles. Maybe you're here to hate watch my videos. Maybe you're here to watch my haul videos. That's something I like to do. I'm a food bank influencer. This is the World Harvest Food Bank at Arlington and Venice in Los Angeles. It's my favorite day of the month when I show up here with my friends and we go in on a giant cart of food for $45. You don't have to be on public benefits. Um, you can also volunteer for four hours for the food. It's so much fun. It's like being on an episode of Supermarket Sweep. And it's Saturday, which means they have the flea market situation in the front. Uh, I'm gonna be here with, uh, I'm going in on a cart with four other friends, which means for nine bucks a piece, we're gonna have enough food to feed us for two weeks. I'm gonna take you in. You're gonna get to meet Glenn, the uh, owner of World Harvest. Oh, oops. here we go. Uh, here we are, the man, the man wow. himself. I'm going to be here with four friends today. This is Glenn. He's yes. going to a wedding. That's why he's missing the gala. I'm going to be honored at with Michelle Yo. It's okay. Wow. And we're 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 here. We're so excited to go shopping today. We miss you, miss you, baby. Miss you. Oh man, you know, thank you Lord for bringing Christina back from New York oh, in one piece. One piece. Uh, Everyone, this is Mia. Mia got into Harvard. Uh, Are you having a bake sale? Is this right? Yes. Yeah, so yeah. Inside the food bank? Oh, oh, okay, cool. Well, we will yeah. buy some baked goods before we go. Congrats on getting to Harvard. I did not get into Harvard. Can you believe it? Well, it's always good to get into Harvard. And then the <laughs> second question is, how am I going to pay to for pay it? For it. There's yeah. gotta be a better way though. Well, yeah, well, with the bake sale. Drugs. But people, Drugs. Are, no, 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 we're not, no, no, we're she's not doing it. She's gonna be a doctor, so. Okay. <laughs> she's gonna be around a, a lot of drugs. All right, we'll get, what did, what did you bake for us today? What kind of things do you have? She'll unpack it, let me, yeah. let me just. Okay, so just on Saturdays, they pull out all the stuff from upstairs, like the dry goods, and it's like, little flea market situation outside so you can buy things for super cheap out here basically um all these uh all these items here have been donated and then you just anyone can come in and buy things that you need for super cheap so i've gotten a lot of contact lens solution from here other stuff like that so it used to be 40 dollars. now it's 45 it's still super cheap you see lots of people so here's the donations they have a lot of these donations are from the airline. I just flew JetBlue yesterday and had some tea, and this is the tea they gave me, it was a trip. No one's wearing masks right now, so I guess I won't, I'm not gonna wear my mask because Glenn's not wearing his, the dog is wearing the, the mask. The dog is wearing the mask. The dog yes. is wearing the mask. Let's see what we got. We've got a, uh, ooh, we've got professional grade food release spray. What do you got, baby, what do you got? <gasps> What's in your refrigerator? Oh, these are the refrigerators bought with my. I've got a birthday coming up, which means you got more fridges coming. Oh God! Yeah. We need, we need okay, double. eggs. Our that's LED great. Refrigerator just took a dump. Oh no! Oh no! Well, you know what? Yes. My birthday's coming up. We're gonna fundraise for another that's industrial great. fridge so that the families in LA can. Oh, look at that! That's great, Mots. Good Mots. Oh yeah, these are good. My friend Pete, I brought these to him in New York. He loves these. Dates, individually wrapped dates. Let's see. This is always fun because you're like, what showed up? Easter, oh, it's Easter soup. These little baby masks for the babies. And then there's, there's all the stuff. This, this I may have to pick up because baby Wong has dandruff, but I'm trying to be a good girl and not accumulate too many things that are not in use, if that makes any sense to anybody. I don't know, someone just did 46 and then dropped these off at the food bank. Mm. Mm -mm. This is the, what we call the uh, apothecary section here. Let's see, I, I, uh, I've been taking uh, multivitamins I've gotten from here, still alive, I am still alive. Let's see what else we got, we got, uh, Lots of diapers. These diapers we end up taking to the Navajo Nation. Um, what else can I show you? So these cards come pre-stacked. So these are things that have to move and there are jeans today. There are jeans in the cart. There are jeans, 
Glenn, Glenn is right there. There's, oh my God, we got egg, oh my God. This, this, Jessica Hannah asked for these. I'm gonna give her these. There's a lot of good stuff here. A lot of, yep, yep, we're gonna do mushrooms. Yes, we are. We're do mushrooms, baby bunches. So how do so we cook these? These are mussels. Cooked. And all you do is throw it in your soup uh -huh. or just like that, butter and garlic. Oh my God. And these That's are right. my favorites, which are oh. New Zealand. Holy crap. Mussels. They just gave away mussels at the food at bank. What food bank gives you mussels? Oh, also, yeah. all this stuff. Look, look at this fancy cheese and stuff. It's crazy. 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 Oh, Since I crazy. broke this, you, you get We'll take this the broken one. We'll take the broken one. I'm going to give you several more. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we uh, look at my my Asian sisters using the shit out of this deal here. We're gonna have forty five okay. bucks, forty five dollars, y'all, forty five. And there's more to come. There's more to come. There's more to come. What you what you got your eye on? Oh yeah, the wheat grain, multi grain. Oh look at this. What is this? This is like rosemary bread or something. Okay, okay, we've been cut off. We have been cut off. We've been told. We have been cut off. <laughs> yes. Okay, we got it. We got the muscles. Muscles. Look at the damage we've made, my friends. Look at the damage. It went out to two carts. All this for 45 and a little bit of change. All right, friends. So I'm about to share the obscenity. That is World Harvest Food Bank. Uh, we went in $9 each on that cart. And then I spent $6 more on like seasonings and stuff, which are not part of the cart. So the stuff like the pantry items in front of the store, you usually buy separately. Sometimes it ends up in the cart, uh, in the preset cart. I know this is confusing, but the point is super cheap, super cheap, super cheap. And then, uh, and then I spent $3 in the swap meat outside for on cosmetics. But basically for food, $16, that's probably gonna get me through the next couple weeks. Amazing, right? Amazing, I'm gonna show you what I got. Okay, first we have, uh, this has been, we've gotten this before, milk, cheese, cheese. <laughs> this is buttermilk bread. Um, nectarines, there's an entire flat of this. There's actually more in the trunk and I'm gonna see how many Jessica wants and I might end up with the leftovers. Uh, a dozen brown eggs and a bag of taco, lettuce that's been pre-cut. Okay, so this is what I spent six extra dollars on. Um, I had all this lettuce, I was like, I guess I should get some salad dressing. So there's a no oil salad dressing. Also, this is like this weird colonizer gochujang. Hmm. But I was intrigued and I had to do it, even though I have a whole like tube of all the red sauce. This I cannot eat, but my current dandruff shampoo is really stinky. So maybe that'll be better. And then, this is actually from JetBlue. When I was just on a flight yesterday, they served me this tea. And I was like, hey, it's the food bank tea. Okay. This has been showing up every month. Liquid hand soap. So useful. I actually need this for my kitchen because we're almost out of soap. Baby carrots. Uh, more things to clean your hands with. And this really nice, elegant bread, which I think has rosemary in it. So I look forward to eating that. That's going to be real tasty. All right, this is this was the random offering today. There was a bunch of clothes at the bottom of the cart, and this is the only one I took back. It's um, this, this is a very plus sized uh, knit denim, brand new with tags. It says a size 28. I don't think that's 28 inches though. Um, but I'm gonna flip that on Poshmark. Okay, this is a box of blanched mussels. I. I have this thing where I don't really cook mussels in my own house because I'm convinced that I'll, I'll have diarrhea, but now I'll have to figure out how to cook mussels in my house. Here they are. All right. Nectarines. This is before I discovered there was a whole box of this under the cart. Um, lettuce, cucumbers, two onions. All right, not easy to see, but these are long. Are these Chinese or Japanese eggplants? They're long eggplants, gailan, and some celery. Uh, these are, what do we call these, banana squashes? I don't remember. Two of these uh, mushroom things. I used to subscribe to, um, uh, what's it? 
I used to get produce delivery and these were like so expensive in them. I mean, I could grab more. I thought I'd grab more. And then three lemons. Okay, two more things I found. I'm bringing these to the office. Uh, a whole box of watermelon sparkling caffeinated water and uh, half and half. Half and half shows up all the time. But we have a office I write in and then uh, people, my fellow coworkers can use it. So that was the food haul. I'm gonna show you the bonus that I got for three bucks outside. Actually, I gave them five bucks. I told them to keep the change, but uh, they were selling these for about a buck a piece. Um, but this is witch hazel, which is something that I use on my skin now, and it costs a lot more than a buck. So anyway, uh, future femininity, here we come. And that, and that was the haul, folks. This is, this is a thrifted coat I just purchased. That smells kind of funny, but anyway, so I do these hauls because uh, it's such an amazing resource in LA. It's so fun to go. It becomes like this event between my friends and I as we organize ourselves to go. And right now food is getting really expensive and that's really make or break for a lot of families. So it's just, it's just my service to let you know that if you live in Los Angeles, this place exists. It's amazing. You can save a ton of money. You can feed yourself healthy food and um and have a lot of fun doing it and feel dignified I, I mean i feel like i'm filled with dignity right now so anyway until our next video thank you for watching it's world harvest at venice boulevard and arlington so check it out